Hello, I'm Antonio Neves, and this is 3 Minute Ad Age. One of the ways that Omnicom's BBDO is adjusting to the digital age is by growing its proximity network. Created about six years ago, the network of ad agencies has 2,000 employees operating in 55 countries. Its focus is heavily on digital, analytics, and electronic customer relationship management. And it's currently expanding into the U.S. with a presence in New York, Chicago, Minneapolis, and Cincinnati. We asked BBDO CEO Andrew Robertson why he considered proximity so special and what are some of the projects that demonstrate that. In terms of some of the most exciting work that's been done, um, you know, I'm, I'm happy to say that proximity, and this is the important point, proximity's proposition is the same as BBDO's. It's about the work, uh, and proximity has consistently won um, the one report over the last five years and um, consistently performs better than any other network at the cables and the echoes. Um, the two pieces of work I would cite, one from, if you like, the, the old world and one from the very new world, are uh, there was a great campaign that was done in London uh, by proximity for the Royal Mail um, designed to uh, dramatize for um, B2B customers, B2B uh, clients, um, the uh, power of, um, of something that ev evoked all of the senses. And, and what they did was they sent 6,000 people uh, a letter, but the letter was written on chocolate, good Mars chocolate. Um, the response was, uh, was really remarkable. I, I think they got a, a return on investment of about five to one. Um, having sent, they sent it to 6,000 people. They got generated something in the region of two and a half million dollars of business from an investment of of about 400,000. So that's on one side using, if you like, the more traditional um, form of direct marketing. At the other end of the scale, um, the best of show at this year's Capels was a campaign that was done uh, by Proximity in New Zealand uh, for Yellow Pages. Um, the challenge again to demonstrate uh, to both consumers and businesses uh, how useful Yellow Pages is. And they had this wonderful idea where uh, uh, they gave somebody the challenge of, uh, of building an entire restaurant in the middle of a forest in a tree um, using nothing but yellow pages and a, and a cell phone and um, generated an enormous amount of um, offline coverage of an event that was then covered in total online. Um, and uh, the restaurant's actually up and running and has had its first 2,000 reservations. And that's it for this three-minute ad age. Thanks for being with us. I'm Antonio Neves at Advertising Age in New York.